boys and girls, cats and squirrels. It this is this is insane. Black Ops Six is officially out. I've streamed twelve plus hours of this game. I don't know what's going on other than the fact that this game hooked. I'm so happy with everything about this. We found all the main Easter eggs now. Unfortunately, they didn't take that long, but I don't mind that much. So if you enjoyed, leave a like, sub, and comment down below. It's much appreciated. It makes you a goat. Thanks so much for watching. Let's get into the discussion. And the real discussion here is how much better is this game than Black Ops Cold War already? Because it, I think it's miles, miles ahead of it. I like, I love Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War, but like, Having I mean, like this skin for beaten the terminus main quest was sick and like having prestige team. skins like samantha's Not pjs talking. or the knocked raider are sick having wonder weapon skins for beating the easter egg is crazy it's it's insane and i love it so much and having three wonder weapons that are you know all completely different and all feel different at launch is really nice the augment system it's a little slow to research these but then again if this is you know if you never relock these then this is totally fine in my opinion because as long as these never relock it just takes us quite a bit of time you know to finish up with all of these which is how long it should take to research all the augments because researching augments it's like really key to the game so this is like their big like you know, thing for zombies this year really in out of game progression oh, i'm not against it then i may not have you know gold on this weapon but the the camo challenges are so good in this game it's just you know with the knives and i believe rocket launchers as well get 2000 kills and then with Brain rot, you know, or armored or blah, 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 get more. And then you 10 kills rapidly, 15 times. 30 special zombie kills, 20 or more consecutive kills without taking damage. And finally, 10 elite zombie kills. It's like, it's really simple to do the camos. It's really fun to do the camos and the camos look really good. I personally have my C9 as my only gold weapon right now and it looks phenomenal but it just whoo, looks so good oh the shine and everything i love it i love it although probably was the wrong time to get a gold since it's the first you know weapon get unlocked but whatever um healing aura frenzy guard aether shroud and even energy mine really feel like they have a good place in this game dark flare i believe was supposed to be a replacement for ring of fire and i think that backfired and i think that was a mistake and this is as far as i can tell basically useless there may be some high run strats with i don't know how you know what you know scales or whatnot that's probably only i can think it's useful then with tacticals i still don't really understand why smokes are in this game for this but whatever thing smoke can kill this is so goofy to me and it feels like there's a lot of you know lethals but it's not bad and the real issue comes with gobble gums i have got other than the ones i base had as you know my vault edition gobble gums i have got one hidden power and that's it for my personal ultras but i think i've been getting pretty unlucky i mean that's fair enough um intel i don't want to burst anyone's bubble but intel is freaking goaded it's not actually the greatest thing ever but i'm happy it's in here because it's like Project Anus investigate investors are causing trouble for Boone Benton, you know, like stuff like this, like especially with now the stuff we have about the Easter egg, you know, we can learn about Dr. Pericles Panos and all these people. And with Terminus the same. We gotta, you know, 
figure this out. Damning evidence. You know, with Nathan, Nathan transferred. And, you know, the documents as well. And artifacts as well. Fortunately, you can't, like, move the ar artifacts in-game. Like, but in Cold War. But it's not the end of the world. Now, metal collection. So cool. This stuff's a little goofy. But leaderboards zombies and maps turn off friends only top two percent top one percent that's crazy bro on the easter egg twice on terminus one uh, twice on liberty i think pretty fun pretty fun i really do enjoy it the easter eggs are gas progression honestly it half feels really slow half feels really fast it kind of really depends but, I'm almost Prestige 1, and that's really good. And that just leads us to where we're at right now. Basically, just, you know, in the game. Which, you know, camel grinding, anything like that. We're not Easter egg hunting, we're not doing anything. We're basically just sitting here like, what do you want to do? And I actually really enjoy that. I look like a mess, because I'm insane. And, yeah, I guess I'm going to go to Liberty Balls around 100. Because my buddy just hit me up for it. So, let's go. Do this. Y'all later. Deuces. Oh my god. What? Huh? What? Craft. Craft? <gasps> okay. Shadow man. Why is it so laggy? What's happening? <laughs> Rick Duffin, Rick Duffin, Rick Duffin. Rick Duffin, Rick Duffin. Damn. So they really are bringing chaos into this. Like, they are bringing chaos Vanguard. back. Well, Vanguard That's brought wild. chaos into it. But, uh, Vanguard did, continuing? but they're really bringing it. No, I'm exiting, bro. Fuck that. No, we don't want to.